What's going on guys? I'm back. It's been a while since I made a video. I want to apologize for the leave I had to take, but I'm officially back. And since I'm back, I figured I'd make a video showing you an awesome new tutorial teaching you how to get Cody on an iPhone the simplest way with no jailbreak or MacBook. Before I start, I do want you to know that you need to have iTunes installed on the computer you will be using to install Cody. To begin, I have made a simple zip file that will have all the files you need. It will be on the description down below for you to download. Once you click the link, it will direct you to this website. From here, you will click download through your browser. This process may take a while, so sit back, relax, just wait for this to fully download. Okay? Once it downloads, we are going to open it. We're going to click extract all up here. We're going to extract it to wherever you want it officially extracted to. From here, we can click the Kodi iPhone, and we'll see all these files. At this point in time, you should have your iPhone connected to your computer. Now we are going to click the impactor. Once the impactor opens up, it should show your iOS device that you have connected. Or this bottom part. Now what we're going to do next is we are going to click on the Kodi 16.1 iOS and we're going to drag it right over there. Over here we are going to enter in our iTunes email and password. The reason is is because you are going to be signing the package that's going onto your iPhone. So over here I'm going to enter in my email and password. After we do that, you're going to see that it's doing all this installing. It'll take a little while, so don't stress it. Once it's all done installing, Kodi should officially be installed onto your iPhone. However, you still can't use Kodi, so let me switch over to my iPhone and show you exactly what we need to do next. Now on the iPhone, you will see that Kodi has been officially installed, but when you do click it, It'll say untrusted developer and that you won't be able to open it unless you go to device management. So what we're going to do next is we're going to go to settings, general, we're going to go down until we see device management. We're going to click the developer app and we're going to click trust. And then we're going to click trust again. And now Cody should be working. And there you have it. All right, guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did enjoy this video, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to watch more videos on Cody. I will be creating new videos every week with new tutorials. All right, guys, till next time.